Okay, so hello and welcome to this weekly energetic clearing reset, getting you set for the week. So everything that's up and active, that's messing with you, that's sticking you, that's limiting you, wow, all of that, do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Ah, yes, I choose that. Whew, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy. Whoa. And banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish. Ah, yeah. So there's been a ton of energies um, up. Like uh, I'm on the West Coast and we just came out of being surrounded by smoke so bad that you weren't supposed to be outside for two weeks. So everything that is, do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Ah, yes, I choose that. Whew, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy. Wow. And the first day that the smoke's cleared, I was walking outside and I felt this release, this freedom that I hadn't felt like even before the, all the COVID stuff. <laughs> Woo. So everything that's still up around COVID, around the elections, around the Supreme Court, <laughs> Woo. and all of that, do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? <sighs> Yes, I choose that. Woo, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize. Ah. Yeah, and I didn't talk about this last time we had our, our live, but I've noticed that I've started to respond differently to the clearings. Like, um, I think you can see me relax after we clear these. And what I'm really getting is that my body is so much more tapping into everyone else's bodies out there. Yeah. And it's one of those parts is just to notice like where your energy, where your awareness changes as you become more aware. And the part around that is like, if you don't notice that, that's okay. Um, it's just like to be paying attention because it, things change or sometimes it seems like our awareness goes up or goes down. Ugh. Yeah. So everywhere it feels like your awareness is going down at times. Ugh. Woo. Do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? <laughs> yes, I choose that. <laughs> vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize. Whoa. Yeah, and it's interesting because um, our, you know, yeah. Okay, so once again, it's just like, it kind of seems like um, in our energetic path that we're not these super amazing, powerful beings. Blah. So everywhere it doesn't feel like you're super powerful, blah, that you're amazing. Blah. Do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? <sighs> yes, I choose that. Vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy. Because we often think that our awareness and our empowerment path is is or should be this, this straight line going up. Blah. So everywhere that hasn't been your experience. Blah. Woo, do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Ah, yes, I choose that. Vaporize, like go five, vaporize, like go five, vaporize, like go five. Woo. Because what's actually going on is while your overall uh, awareness and empowerment path is going up like that, and it is, if you tapped into how you were a year ago and where you are now, it's so much higher. But um, what's actually going on as you're going on your awareness path is you're going up and and it's it's kind of like this, these cyclic things generally going up, but they drop down. And often what happens is because we get so used to feeling good for feeling like clearing the crap that's in our lives, that when we drop down even a little bit, it can feel as bad as it did before we even started our empowerment path. And everything that brought up, do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Ah, yes, I choose that. Vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy. Ah, yeah. And the thing is, is even in your, your most down times now, you're so much higher than you were. You're so much further along your path than you were when you first started. Yeah, and everywhere it doesn't feel like that. Do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Ah. Yes, I choose that. Vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize. <laughs> banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish. Ah. 
yeah. And I get it because I have times like that too. You know, it's just like, oh my gosh, I, sometimes I feel like my clearings were so much more powerful like a year ago. Blah. Blah. Yeah, so everywhere it seems like you were able to easily clear stuff a while ago. Blah. That's harder for you to do now. Blah. <laughs> Yikes. Woo. You just release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now. And everything that says no, freeze all, pre-scan all, pre-tag all, pre-ID all, pre-encapsulate all, and whew, out, 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 out. Banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish. Yeah, and it's one of those ones is I've talked about before about how energetic forces use all kinds of trickery to make it seem like you're not as powerful as you truly are. Yeah. So all the trickery that they've been using. Yeah. And all the manipulation that makes it seem like you're not as strong, you're not as powerful, you're not as capable, Ooh, not as capable <laughs> as you were at other times in your life. Ah. Do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? <sighs> yes, I choose that. Vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy, retract, rescind, revoke, recant, renounce, make null and void, make null and void, <laughs> make null and void, make null and void. Well, because often what's actually going on here is even though it seems like you're dealing with the same thing, you're actually dealing it with on it on a much deeper level. Woo! Yeah, there you go. Yeah. And so why it seems like it's harder to clear some things now that previously you could just easily have cleared or removed woo, is because you're actually getting at deep areas that require more energy. Woo. Yeah, but once again, because it seems like it's a similar thing and it feels the same because it's the same, it's the same part, same frequency, same energy. Woo. Yeah, it makes it seem like you're not as strong as you were. Yeah. But yeah, so all the manipulation around that, that's preventing you from seeing your authentic and current strength, Ooh, your authentic and current capacity. Woo. Ooh, whoa, do you feel that? Yeah. Do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Ah, yes, I choose that. Vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy, vaporize. Ooh, wowza. Yeah, and I get it. And then one of the other parts is as you become um, more and more aware, more and more capable on your empowerment path, you perceive things on a different level. You're perceiving things um, that previously you didn't even know, know were there. And so that's one of those other parts that can kind of be, it's like, why aren't things, why aren't things so much easier than they were when you started? <laughs> yeah. So everywhere that if this stuff really worked, Ugh. these energetic clearings really worked, things would be so much easier now. <laughs> Yuck. And everything that brought up, do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Oh, yes, I choose that. Vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy. Uh, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish. Yeah, because what's actually going on is each of the clearings you're doing now, you're clearing more and more than you did previously. And so maybe an example of this is it's kind of like, like when you're cleaning dirty dishes. You know, um, the first little bit, like, you know, you try to just rinse it off and some stuff comes off. Oh, yeah. And then the next level is you use a sponge and you're and you get another level off whoa and then finally when the, there's that stuck on stuff that just can't come off whoo yeah you have to get out the scratch pad or some steel wool or something like that Blah. and that's what i look at is what's going on here is when you first start out you're easy you can get the easy gunk off you know it's the, it's, it's easy because you have a new tool you have a sponge you wipe that off and what we're doing now is we're using the big strong tools and you notice that when you have something that's really stuck on the bottom of the pan you don't just do one little wipe with uh, the steel wool or scratch pad you have to like scrub it a little bit yeah yeah so all the things that you decided you should just instantly be able to change and clear Whoa, that's a lot. Whoa. Do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Uh, yes, I choose that. Vaporize, like, I vaporize. Like, so all the things you decided that you should just easily be able to clear that actually take a little bit more work or take a little bit more time. Ooh, a little bit more time. Do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? <sighs> yes, I choose that. Vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy. Now, I want to like say a little bit more about what my philosophy is and all this stuff. So my philosophy still is that there's so much stuff that we can instantly change and clear with um, the processes and the clearings and the receivings we do in this work. And that's my first thought. 
So when I approach any problem, anything that I would like to change, any challenge, my first thought is, yes, we can change it, all of it right here, right now. But what often happens if it doesn't completely change, we either think something's wrong with us, ooh, something's wrong with you. Ah. Yeah, so everywhere you decided that something doesn't instantly change with the tools that should be able to make it change, ooh, that that means there's something wrong with you. Ah. Or you're not good enough. Ooh. Do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Ah, yes, I choose that. Vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy. Right. And so the whole philosophy I use is that um, we're going to approach any challenge, one, that we can win, two, that we can change it, and three, that it can change very quickly. Now, the part is if it doesn't change quickly, or the thing is, is like a lot of things that we do, they're always going to lighten up. They're always going to be easier, but sometimes there's still stuff there. And that is not to go that there's anything wrong with you, there's anything wrong with the tools. It's just that it requires a little bit more clearing, processing, or even time. So everywhere that there's still things in your life that you would like to change, woo, ah, ah, and all of those you've been making wrong because they haven't changed, woo, do you choose to release, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Yes, I choose that. Retract, rescind, revoke, recant, renounce, make null and void, make null and void, make null and void, make null and void. Woo. Awesome. Okay, so let's set, let's set this up for uh, a good week. So what's everything in the way of you having a good or even a great week this week? Yeah. And everywhere that it's not possible to have a great week, yeah. do you choose to remove and destroy all that? Yeah. Yes, I choose that. Retract, rescind, revoke, recant, renounce, make null and void, make null and void, make null and void, make null and void. Ooh. So what's everything in the way of you having a good or even a great week this week? Ooh. So everything that's in the way of you having a good or even a great week, do you choose to remove, let go, and or allow all that to be removed from your reality now? Ah, yes, I choose that. Vaporize, liquefy, vaporize, liquefy, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish, banish, vanquish. Awesome. Okay, so no matter where you're watching this, scroll down, give me a thumbs up, uh, give me a response. Let me know what's going on in your life and in your reality. And let's go get them this week. Okay, see you again soon. Bye for now.